<laughs> Hulk! You have to be strong to be a sailor! <laughs> Oh, hey guys! Hello. We are here in La Paz eating some ice cream. Gorgeous ice cream. Enjoying our time here. It's super nice here. Weather's awesome. And we just were talking about how nice the trip down the coast was, and I think it, it's good if we just record it. Let's talk about the trip down south here. First ice cream. Yeah, the trip was really nice. We had awesome weather. And I think it never rains during the trip. Was no. it? No. No, never. no rain. We had calm water, calm weather only once during Abriojos and Mac McBain. Yeah, we had some wind. We had winds up to 25 knots and um, rougher water, but sea state was maybe three, four maximum five meter waves but that was okay zero can handle that we could handle that yeah trip was really comfy it was all downwind we had to take down the spinnaker though but you know if zero has 25 knots of wind we don't need a spinnaker she's no. flying <laughs> and we did once nine knots of boat speed with the yeah. spinnaker up only the spinnaker i tell you i love that spinnaker when we put up the spinnaker we can fly it by with i mean we actually did it in the sea of Cortez in calm water with just two knots of wind, it was just gently pushing us. Not fast, but we were still moving, had we enough rudder high. pressure for the autopilot. But outside on the Pacific, we had the spinnaker up. Actually, it's a Jenica, asymmetric spinnaker. And it was blowing up to 12, 13, 14 knots. And I thought about, ah, you're gonna take it down. Then we had to blow up to 17 knots, which is actually quite a little bit for that spinnaker. But, um, it was just a little gust, it was gone by after a couple of minutes and then it went down to 14 again. And in this blow we did 9 knots, only on the spinnaker. Nice. That was awesome. Yeah, the best thing on the trip was, I guess, when we sailed around to Cabo, the south, oh, yeah. south cap of Baja California. Finally arriving. And it was like, boom, right now we have summer, we don't need any more clothes, water is warm around 30, 30 degrees of Celsius and it yeah. was definitely the best day. It was pretty much like like within a finger snip. I mean we were we were rounding the cave. That was awesome. Lance and we hooked actually a, um, a bonito <laughs> in that moment and all of a sudden it was warm, there was no more uh, waves and it was warm wind. It was still blowing, it was a windy day. But it was warm and we the water temperature just got up and that yeah. was awesome. We Pretty could nice. we could store all our warm clothes immediately, just dropping off and jumping into the water naked. And Cabo was just the start of the warm weather. Yeah. It, it was getting hotter and hotter, getting up north again in the yeah. Sea of Cortez. And yeah, from nice. Cabo to here in La Paz, it is just gorgeous weather. I mean, it's not much wind. But we made it up here without using the engine too much and we could swim everywhere. We just jumped overboard uh, while we were sailing when we were just drifting on the spinnaker yeah. with one and a half knots. Swimming so. and diving with manta rays and oh, yeah. fans and it was really great. And then Espiritu Santo, wow. Great. We checked the island out before we went to La Paz yeah. and that was very good. Awesome, awesome base. beaches and turquoise water and jumping mantas, turtles. turtles and just great. And no many other boats. I mean, we were pretty yeah. much alone. And now? We're in La Paz. We're in La Paz. Now for me, the trip uh, ends for a little stop over to Germany. Yeah, tomorrow. I'll leave tomorrow for two months to uh, pass some exams at Germany in the university. You gotta go back to normal university life. life. <laughs> Unfortunately, but I have to. <laughs> Break is over. Yeah. Yeah. Get straightened out again. 
No more lying in the sun, swimming with dolphins. No, no Turtles. more boats. We had some nice days together in La Paz before I had to leave. It was nice to see a little bit of La Paz history while walking around town. We drove with the dinghy to the outer land side of the bay and enjoyed the view of La Paz from another point of view. The last days in La Paz, especially for me, were really nice. A school of dolphins swam around zero to say goodbye and a last beautiful evening on board with an awesome red colored sunset went by way too fast. We enjoyed the last hours together on board Zero. The next day we drove to the airport and said goodbye for the next two and a half months. <laughs> Are you sweating out of your eyes? It's too hot. <laughs> A few exams later, we will see us again for another awesome adventure together. Don't forget to subscribe if you don't have subscribed already. And check out Patreon and thanks a lot for all your support you did already. There will be some nice rewards soon. Yeah. Thanks for watching and we'll see us again in a couple months. Hello, I'm out. Bye.